guys, it's the Mama J. Now today I have an unboxing video for you from two different companies. The first one I want to talk about is the BioDude. Now the BioDude is a great company that sells a lot of different bioactive supplies for your vivarium. I've ordered uh, some substrates as well as some plants from them. And also I have ordered some supplies from Mid-South Isopods and Microhertz. Um, in this case, I've ordered some isopods to add to some of my existing vivariums. So let's get started on that unbox. What we're going to get into is the BioDude. So let's cut it open here and see what we got. Okay, um, now when we first open the box, uh, this is how we've got it packaged. Um, it looks like they've done a great job of uh, padding everything. And the first thing on top here is going to be our biodegradables. Now our biodegradables are going to be our organic leaf litter. That's something that will go on the top of our bioactive tanks. This also provides really good food for the springtails and isopods that we're going to add. Okay, the second thing in the box here is the terra fauna. Now the terra fauna is some of our uh, bioactive substrate and the really great thing about that is that it holds a lot of humidity um, which is a really important thing when it comes to crested or gargoyle geckos. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Okay, I've got a little care guide on plants. Here's the BioShot. This is also a uh, fertilizer um, boost that we can Okay, the last thing on the bottom here is the Hygro Grow. Now that is something that will be our first layer in the tank. Let's see here what else we got. Lots of packing material. And this would be my plants. Now, I ordered a plant kit that is specific for uh, geckos, and I'm excited to see what that is. Okay, on the top of this box, uh, I've also got some mesh liner here. Now, this is something that will also be layered in the bioactive tank uh, in between your uh, hydro grow and your other substrate. And we also have another uh, bag of biodegradables. This is our sphagnum moss. This is also a great product to help hold in humidity. Oh, wow. Now this is a new type of plant for me. Um, this is a live moss, and it's not something I've ever tried before, but it's, it's like a pillow moss, and I think this is gonna make a really great addition to the tank, uh, provide some really nice areas for the geckos to climb over. Okay, now for our plants. Okay, he's got it packaged really good. Here is some paper and looks like paper towel for humidity. Oh wow, this is just, what a beautiful plant. Okay. Now this is one of the bromelades. Uh, this is really beautiful. It's got uh, some green and purple coloration, and it's a nice sturdy plant that I think will do really well in a gecko vivarium. Let's see what this other one is. Oh wow. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. That's gonna make a really nice background plant. Okay, well, let's check out the isopods real quick and then we'll get to our tank builds. We'll have all the stuff we need. Now, if you've never built a bioactive tank before, I really encourage you to try it. Um, the whole idea was a little bit uh, overwhelming to me when I first started, but I have to say it really is an easy thing to put together and it makes a great habitat for your animal. There we go. Now, this is the first time that I have ordered isopods in the mail. 
but I was really impressed with this company. Okay, so I'll show you the little container that I've got here. Now, isopods apparently come in lots of different colors. Um, these particular ones that I've ordered are called flowery blue. So they'll have a little bit of a nice blue coloration to them. I'll see if I can hold them up here so you can kind of get a little bit of an idea of what they look like. But she has them in a really nice, uh, damp little container here. And they all look very healthy. So these are going to make a great addition as the cleanup crew that really helps make your bioactive tank self-sustaining. And I ordered uh, three of these containers because I'm adding them to three different tanks. All right. Well, that's it for our unboxing video. Thanks so much. See you next time.